Hi everyone. So I went shopping this past weekend and I bought some things at Kirkland's and I found some really good deals at Walmart and I thought that I would share them all with you guys today. It's not really that much. That's why I'm kind of combining um, these, you know, two little small hauls together. So let's get started. So for Costco, we actually got coupons in the mail because of where I work and where my mom works. I don't know. That was one of the questions that they asked us when we joined. Um, where you guys employed and when we told them they said oh my gosh you're going to be getting these extra coupons in the mail so long story short my mom got the coupons she lost the coupons she found the coupons and then she gave them to me um, and in the little booklet it was just kind of like two pages of ripoff coupons they had free items and I was like trying to read the fine print looking to see okay, what do I need to buy to get these free items? There has to be a catch, and there wasn't a catch. So I actually got a free rotisserie chicken, and this was completely free. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shred this up and make chicken noodle soup in the crock pot, but I just thought, oh my gosh, it's fully cooked. It's the Kirkland brand. It's got no added hormones or steroids. So I don't know, I thought that that was really nice of them to give me a free chicken. And then also they had a free two pack of bagels. Now these are the Kirkland bagels. Um, I have been told that these, the Parmesan bagels are literally to die for. They retail, I don't know how much they retailed for. So I just didn't know which ones to get. I think they had oatmeal raisin, the Parmesan, the plain, and one other one, maybe wheat or something like that. I don't know. So I just, being my first time, I got the plain, and then I also got the Parmesan cheese. Um, so yeah, so, and they smell amazing. I think they're going to be really, really nice for in the morning for, you know, a quick go for breakfast just to eat like half of a bagel. Um, and then my mom was shopping around. She had gone there specifically for, you know, a specific item. And I was kind of looking like in the Easter candy. I don't know why I was in the Easter candy, you guys. But anyway, I was just looking kind of like all over the store. And I'm literally addicted to Werther's Original Candy. My mouth gets dry because I talk a lot. So I found this big bag of Werther's Originals. This is the Caramel Shop Celebration, and it's got the whole assortment in here. It's got the hard caramels, the toffee crunch, soft caramel, Snooki's excited too. The caramel chocolate, the creamy caramel filled, hard caramel, and then the chewy caramel. And this was only $5 and some change, so I was just excited about it, and I thought, why not? What the hell? Ugh. All she does is bark at me, you guys, lately. What's going on with you, Snooky Louise? She doesn't even know. Okay, you're going to have to go back here then. Okay, so now let's do the Walmart haul. Um, What was I looking for at Walmart? Oh, Liquid Drano. I bought a big thing of Liquid Drano because my um, sink in my bathroom was clogged and I don't even know what it was, but I used the Liquid Drano Max and it completely worked. So I was happy about that. Okay, so when I went into Walmart, I actually darted right for the candle section because I was looking for wax. Um, some wax milks by Sensationals and Better Homes and Gardens and I found some. But while I was looking, I found this. This is by Yankee Candle and this is the American Home um, in the Banana Walnut Bread. Oh my gosh, you guys, this smells amazing. This was on clearance and I, I remember smelling these when they first came out, but this was on clearance for $2. Really good deal. Um, I don't even know how many ounces are in here. Four, it's just like a four ounce candle, but perfect for the bathroom around fall time, I feel. And then I also got this one, Shades of Fall. They also had pumpkin ones there, and I was just like, I can't get into a pumpkin scent right now. You know, it's it's almost spring, and I just, I can't do it. So I just picked up those on a whim. And then I also went over to the grocery aisle, and I did find a brand new candle by um, the Walnut Avenue brand, and this is in Caribbean Villa. And this, you guys, smells so good. These candles are actually made by the same manufacturer that Bath & Body Works Three Wicks candles are made from. This is $4.95, and Bath & Body Works candles are $22.50. So you do the math and figure it out. Um, 
This one smells so tropical and nice. It's a mix of like a pina colada with a coconut and like a cabana boy or something. I don't know, it smells really good. But the description reads, um, find your own seaside retreat with a tropical blend of fruits, coconut milk, and sugar cane. And it just smells amazing. And I'm gonna be doing a review on this one for sure. Now comes the wax melts. Um, let me see, I only picked up a few um, and I didn't get any duplicates just because, I mean, I was just kind of quickly looking. So I got pink velvet and everybody has been talking about this new scent pink velvet and I feel like I've had this before and I don't know why I it's a brand new scent but I just feel like this picture reminds me of something that I already had but it, it just smells really good it's sugar vanilla you know definitely like your classic kind of pink sugary scent but it looks like this and then this one I've been seeing flying around Facebook um, for a while now and everybody picking it up and loving it. This is by Sensationals and it is called Love Letters. Um, this one is just cedarwood, vanilla, and almond. But oh my gosh, you guys, it smells amazing. Oh, it smells so good. Um, this would be really, really nice for a bedroom, I feel. This is not, I don't think, like a living room area. This is more like a bedroom, bedroom feel for me. And then I also picked up this one, uh, Violet Sugar. I absolutely, I, I don't think violets have a smell, but like whenever violets are offered in a scent, I love it. This is a sweet combination of wild violet and sugar, and it is purple in color. Oh, it just smells so good, you guys. Love it. Then I also had to get this one by Better Homes called Spring Day or Rainy Spring Day. It just reminded me of spring. It's a very nice, fresh, clean scent, and I thought that it would be good for, you know, springtime right now. Even though we have four inches of snow on the ground, it's still considered spring. Um, then this one by Sensationals is Cherry Berry. I don't know if this is a new one, but I'm a sucker for cherry scents, so I had to pick it up. Oh, smells just like juicy cherry bubblicious bubblegum. It smells so good. And then the last one I got by Sensationals is Daydream. That's what this one looks like here. It says lush greens and spiced jasmine. Um, it says limited edition. And it just, this one has like a little kick to it um, of a little like greenery note, but it's sweet at the same time. It just, it smells absolutely delicious. Um, the jasmine in it is gorgeous, but yeah, so that's what I got at Costco and Walmart. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any of the Sensational or Better Homes and Gardens, please leave a comment down below and letting me know which scent is your favorite or which one you guys like or dislike. Um, and also, about the Costco coupons, will we still be getting those coupons? Um, now, I'm not talking about the booklets that they come out with like once a month. I'm talking about actual coupons that you can like tear off and use. Um... Is that just like a one-time thing, you think? I don't know. I'm just wondering. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you all later. Bye-bye.